Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? From here to find the value of x, let's write this again as 2 raised to the power 3, then 2 raised to the power x minus, here we have 2 raised to the power x, then equals to root 2 from here. Then from here, we can interchange this power from the law of uh, indices and this can be written as 2 raised to the power x then raised to the power 3 minus 2 raised to the power x then equals to root 2 from here then we have 2 raised to the power x common so let a letter let y be equal to 2 raised to the power x then from here we can write this again in term of y and we have y raised to the power 3 then minus y equals to root 2 and uh, in the next step we can raise this side everything to power 2 and also raise this side to power 2 so that the square we cancel the square root here we have 2 left then this power of 2, when we expand this, we have y raised to the power 3 squared, then minus 2 times y raised to the power 3 times y, which is raised to the power 1, then plus y squared, and is equal to 2 from here. And this becomes y raised to the power 6. Going to multiply 3, then minus here, we sum this together, plus we have same base, that's 2 raised to power, 2y raised to power 4, then plus, here we have y squared, then equal to 2. And in the next step, when we group this together, these two terms, we have y raised to power 4 common, so we factor it out. And here we have y squared left minus here we have 2 left then plus we have y squared then when we take 2 here we have minus 2 now equals to 0 then from here these two also we can group it together this way then we discover that we have y squared minus 2 common so we factor that out we have y squared minus 2 then what is left here we have y raised to the power 4 then plus what is left here will be 1 then equals to 0 here and here we have two cases we have y squared minus 2 equals to 0 or we have y raised to the power 4 plus 1 equals to 0 and from here we have y square equals to when we take minus here we have 2 then here we have y raised to power 4 equals to here we have minus 1 and uh, we should recall that we let y to be equals to 2 raised to power x so when we bring that here, that is we have y equals to 2 raised to power x. That means from here, since y is 2 raised to power x, that means 2 raised to power x. Then square will be equal to 2 from here. Then this is, you know, expected to be positive and this also is a positive number. So this is accepted. And here as well we have 2 raised to power x, that's y, which is raised to power 4. And here we have minus 1. So here this will be positive. And uh, here this is negative. So this will be rejected. So we reject this side. Then on this side when we walk, you know, further here, we have... This power multiplies and this becomes 2 raised to the power 2x 
now equal to here the same thing as 2 raised to the power 1. So we have same base here. Then we equate the power. So we have 2x equal to 1. And when we divide both sides by 2 from here, we have this cancel out. And we have x here equals to 1 over 2. So here we have x to be equal to half from here. Then let's check if this satisfies the given problem. From what we have, which is 8 raised to power x minus 2 raised to power x, which is equal to root 2. Now, for x equal to half, this will become 8 raised to power half minus 2 raised to power half is equal to root 2. Then, here, 8 raised to power half, same thing as square root of 8. Then here, also, we have square root of 2 is equal to square root of 2 here. Then, root 8 can be written as root 4 times 2, then minus root 2, and it is equal to root 2 here, so that we separate root 4 out. So root 4 there, same thing as 2, then we have root 2 minus root 2 is it equal to root 2. Now from here, 2 root 2 minus root 2, same thing as root 2, which is equal to root 2. So we have left hand side equals to right hand side. And uh, hence, from here we conclude that x equals to half satisfies this given uh, problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos and turn on the notification bell. Share this video with a thumbs up. See you in next class and bye for now.